Okay, so um, the objective we have today for this video is to find out the relationship between these shapes that we have. We have a square prism, we have a cylinder, and we have a square pyramid, we have a cone, and we have a sphere. So we're just looking for the relationship between um, any of these objects. So I noticed that they all seem to be the same height. And are they all the same shape? Okay, these two are the same shape. If we take... They have the same base. The same base. Yeah, they have Got the same... The both of those are square, so they have the same base. Now, what if we look at these? Okay, so that same, same circle... So everything that's a circle is the same. So all the circles are the same. And all the squares are the same. So it seems to me that these three go together and these two go together. Because they're the same height and the same base. Right, the same height and the same base. Mm -hmm. These are the same height and the same circle. So okay. let's look at them that way. Okay. Let's we'll start with these three. All right, so what are we going to try first? Well, let's fill them with water and see how they compare in volume. Because okay. remember that volume is what fits inside. Right. So. Um, Let's fill the, the cone because it looks like it's the smallest. All right. So here's okay. one cone. What should I put it in? Put it in the, in the cylinder. cylinder. Okay, right. so how full does it look to you? Well, it's less than half. It's Maybe definitely less than half. A third or a fourth? Yeah, I'm not sure if it's a third or a fourth. I wonder how we can figure out if it's a third or a fourth. Well, if we... Fill the cone again. Let's try that. Okay. See what happens. So now I have two cones in there. Well, it's definitely more than half, so... So it wasn't a fourth. Wasn't because a fourth. if it had been a fourth, we'd have half. Right. And we have more than half, so... I'll bet one more will fit in there. One Let's more? Let's try one more. One more, okay. Perfect. Yeah. So what does that mean? That means that, it means that three, three cones, cones are going to fit in the cylinder. Equals the cylinder. So I'm going to write that up here. Okay. Okay. Three cones equal one cylinder. So I put one cone in here. So after we decided that three cones fills the cylinder, what would one cone do to the cylinder? So one cone equals one third of the cylinder. Right, because I can put three cones in there. So, so we should write that down too. Okay, so one cone equals one third cylinder. Okay, okay cool. So, we know we have one cone in here. What if we put that in the sphere? See what happens. This okay. Just one yep. cone, right? Right. Let's see if I can do it without spilling. So, one cone equals half. Yeah, it's definitely half. So, one cone equals half of a sphere. All right. One cone equals one-half sphere, which means if we fill that cone up again and pour it into our sphere, it should, if we're right, it should fill the sphere. This is going to tax my spilling. That's good. Is it all the way? Yep. Oh, perfect. All so right. what does that mean? It means two cones equals equals one full sphere. sphere. But what okay. if I put this, this, the full sphere in the cylinder? Well, we know that the, it takes three cones to fill the 
the cylinder, cylinder and I have two cones in the sphere. So then this must be two thirds full. of the cylinder. So one sphere equals two thirds of a cylinder. That's right. One sphere equals two thirds of a cylinder. cylinder. Oh, we've got a lot of relationships here. So we have a sphere in there. Can we put a cone in there too? If that's two thirds, and we said that one cone is a third of a cylinder, that should be perfect. It should fit. It should fit perfectly. So I already have one sphere in there, and now I'm going to put one cone in there. And it's perfect. And it gives me one cylinder. So one sphere plus one cone equals one cylinder. Right. So should we add that one up here? Yes. One sphere plus one cone equals one cylinder. Can you think right. of any other ones that we could do? I think we have a lot. We do. 